Hi there, it's Prof Gordon from Exam Success. I'm glad that you have decided to join me as your study partner for the CFP exam. And I wanted to just walk you through the materials to be able to give you a guide of how to approach this. So after you've signed in, you're on your dashboard and you will see the components that make up the uh, CFP complete study package. Uh, you're you're going to be in the welcome uh, you'd hit that first to go through, uh, and obviously you uh, you uh, are in this uh, if you're going through the uh, the uh, welcome already. Uh, you will see the uh, a seminar, the recorded seminar, and how to answer the constructed response questions. Uh, this is a great tool to give you a framework of how you should approach uh, answering the questions. There's a couple of sample cases in there as well. Uh, you'll see the study notes, which cover the technical knowledge that covers the body of knowledge from FP Canada that you need to cover. And I'll go through that in a little more depth. Uh, math workbook. If you uh, need help uh, with the calculations, then this is the place to go. Uh, if you haven't used a calculator in many, many years, you'll see a lot of great resources there. If you have a strong background or if you're comfortable using your calculator, then there's no need to be to be going through this. Uh, um, you know, uh, it's uh, additional work. Some people like to go through it uh, just to make sure they've covered everything, but it, it is covered in other areas of the resources. So I don't want you wasting your time feeling like you're doing things that are redundant. The CFP test bank, this is where we have the constructed response case studies and some multiple choice questions to help you apply your knowledge. So you're going to use this test bank in conjunction with the study notes uh, to as your primary tools to be able to go through and learn the material. And if you scroll down a little further, there's some frequently asked questions here, you know, uh, that if you have uh, come across anything, uh, you know, can you get a receipt, you signed in, you know, what's happening, a couple of questions. Otherwise, you can always reach out. Out. You know, my, my uh, objective is to be here to help you uh, provide support along the way. There's a welcome video as well, which goes into a little bit of an overview as well. So this is your dashboard where you'll uh, come in and you will um, get going. So the first thing that you should do to get started is uh, go to the study notes. So we'll click on this it will open up and you'll see the you'll see a welcome message from me <laughs> again uh you'll see all of the uh all of the concept, the topics uh, listed in the menu down here on, on the side and you can click on them they will expand you will see the notes the notes are pdfs so you can print those off uh, and uh, you can uh, you can read them online if you'd like. Okay, so uh, um, it's uh, it's up to you. These are for your personal use. Okay, uh, you can go through them. And again, you know, as I said many times, uh, you know, if you're on a short, you know, kind of time frame and you really need to get to the need to know, you got to go through these study notes. You know, you'll see them in each section. You know, if I drop to the investment planning, here's the investment planning notes. OK, and uh, and uh, you can go through them. You, you can print them off. If you have any questions, you just hit the discussion button at the top here. It will open. You'll see people have questions. And I answer those questions to help you go through the material. Uh, you'll also see other types of uh, uh, learning exercises and files that I've posted up here uh, that I think you should need to know. You know, the behavioral finance, I added in a little uh, extra. Uh, there's a, a basics on investment products. You know, if you're comfortable with this, you don't have to go through all of these additional items. Some students were asking me for more in-depth material, so I've gathered some uh, other uh, uh, items. I've created learning examples you should go through those to practice okay but you'll start to see that there's uh, that there's a number of uh, resources here I've put in some you know short teaching videos also you know where I walk you through some of these items here again you know this just depends upon your time frame you can go through some of these quick teaching you know uh, uh, clips and, uh, and I put them in there because they may have come from some questions from, from uh, some previous students. You know, even in me on the old uh, chalkboard there is I used to teach in class, teaching some of this material. But the key is to make sure that you go through, you, you get the notes. Okay, here's the retirement planning. Here they are. They're, they're listed first. Then I have other 
uh, um, other documents where I found, you know, people, again, you know, they wanted a little more in depth, okay? So uh, I put these in there, okay? Do you have to go through every single one of these items? Uh, um, again, it depends upon your time frame. okay? The notes are the things that you want to make sure that you get going through. The learning examples that I have, make sure you go through those as well. I think those are, are something which you should you can use uh, really to um, enhance your learning and help prepare you for this exam. Uh, you can go back to your dashboard by clicking at the top and it'll take you back here and you can now, you know, see whatever you've gone into, the last item will, will come to the, to the, uh, be reordered in the front here. Uh, we can go into the test bank and in the test bank, I've broken this up again. Here's another introduction. Uh, uh, I've broken this up. You know, if you, if, you, if you need a tutorial on how to use the calculators, you can see, you know, actually pushing buttons, different calculator models. This is the Texas Instruments model. Okay, if you've got the Sharp or the HP, I've got the, the tutorials for those as well. Okay, so if you're comfortable with your calculator, then there's no need to go through these videos. Okay, it's all about using your time efficiently to cover the body of knowledge, to get prepared for the exam. And then I've got these uh, sections that are related to the body of knowledge. You can go through these uh, uh, practice sets, you know, uh, budgeting and cash flow, and you can read through. And I want you just to get experience being able to go through. Uh, um, you know, this is a system where you have to write on paper. It's not online, okay? And it's not marked automatically. You've got a piece of paper beside you, you know, answering the question, uh, okay, create a, a net worth statement and a cash flow statement. Uh, and then you click on the, uh, the, uh, the uh, answer there and then uh, hit confirm and you will get your guideline answer and any commentary that I have, and you can go to the next question in this item, in, in this uh, uh, set of questions and repeat the process. So I've given my comments and your know, calculations, show you how to do this. I've got this, uh, you know, there's uh, there's uh, throughout the sections, many different type of, uh, of uh, concepts covered. And as you're going through, if there's something that you don't know, again, you can just reach out, hit the discussion button. You see people have questions here and I answer those questions. And uh, that way you're moving through the material and I'm helping you along the way to build your knowledge to be able to uh, get ready for the exam. You can go back to your dashboard, okay? And, uh, uh, you know, if you are struggling with the, the, uh, the uh, constructed response, you know, you know, I'd say go right to this, uh, how to answer the constructed response, uh, um, this, uh, this recorded seminar, okay? And, uh, and uh, here's an introduction. And uh, you can see I've got some case questions here. Uh, I've got the solutions. I've got the recording. So you, you, the, there's a PDF for this. And uh, uh, if I start to go through the recording, you know, this, uh, like I said, you know, I taught this and to a group of students and we really went through and I was explaining the, the logic, the thinking behind these, these answers. Okay. And, uh, and, you know, it's a really great way for you to be able to, understand you know how to frame your answers to to give the graders the opportunities to award your marks you know how i think they break down the marks so uh, it's a, it when you're ready to start tackling you know questions you'll know, go through this uh this uh how to answer the constructed response questions uh seminar it's about two hours and um and and then there's a couple of cases in here as well for practice so it's really geared towards practice. Okay. I really want you to get up to speed and practice the math workbook. Like I said, you know, this is, it is a, uh, it is a workbook. Uh, you can click on the workbook. It's a PDF, uh, uh, uh file here it is. Uh, and, uh, and it covers the financial math all the way from the basics, you know, square roots and exponents. If you have experience, okay. And you're comfortable with math then you don't have to go through every single page here, okay? You know, again, uh, I did this because a lot of my learners and uh, are are you know haven't touched a calculator in years, so uh, you can go through this uh, you know resource. Uh, but if you're comfortable, like I said, it, it's something that uh, again uh, you you do not have to cover in depth. 
So uh, these components here, uh, these, uh, these make up the complete study package. And this is where you will get all of the knowledge that you need to be able to uh, uh, challenge that CFP exam and be successful uh, on exam day. Okay, so I hope this was uh, was a good overview for you. If you have any questions at all, like I said, you know, reach out, hit the discussion buttons, or uh, send an email info at examsuccess.ca, uh, and I'm here to help you and guide you through. All right, so now it's time to get on to studying. And from this point forward, so now you've got to go and go to the uh, CFP complete study package notes. That's the first place I'd say again, remember, go there, print off the notes or uh, save them on your computer, you know, for your personal use. And then and then you can start going through the material. All right. Now you got to get down to, to to work. We'll see you in a few other videos.